Miss Rachel, your phonics teacher, welcome back to our lesson for today, grade 2, lesson 9. Today's topic is suffix. The topic is what again? Suffix. What is a suffix? I know you've been fixing many things with your hands. You fix your shoes, you fix your desk sometimes, and even your bed. This time in words, a suffix is not just the physical hard work we do to put things together. It's a letter or a group of letters added to the end of a word to form a new word. They are not words, but letters that can be added at the end of existing words. When you add those letters, you form new words. Let's take examples of some of these letters that are suffixes. We have number one here, ing. ing is a suffix because it cannot stand on its own, but it can be added at the end of a word to make another word like cook. When we add ing, we get cooking. ed, look. When we add ed, we get looked. EST is another suffix. Here yeah, is short. When we add EST, we get shortest. Nest is another suffix. When we add nest to full, we get fullness. Now let's quickly look at some sentences with words and try to identify suffixes in these words in the sentences. Number one, we have the teacher asks us to stop running. Look intently, you're going to find suffixes in these words. I can see ER at the end of teach to give me teacher. I can see ED at the end of ask to get asked. And I can see ING at the end of run to get running. Number two, she is the fastest pupil so far. I can see EST at the end of smartest. She is the smartest pupil so far. EST is added to smart. Number three, come closer to see the full view. I can see ER at the end of close to get closer. Number four, I cannot, I cannot, okay, sorry, I can no longer visit them today. I can no longer visit them today. Can you see any suffix in this sentence? Very well. I can also see ER, longer. Okay, we have identified suffixes as letters we add to the end of words to make new words. They are not words per se, but they are letters that when you add them to the end of existing words, you can form new words like ing, ed, est, ness, er, and so on. Now let's see if you can do some interesting work at home. Very interesting one this time. You have to add the correct suffix. Long. What's the correct suffix to go with long? Is it longest or longly? Please do justice to it. Good. Is it goodness or gooder? Is there any word like gooder? I don't know. Please pick the correct suffix to match with it. Fast. Is it fast mate or fasting? Well, enjoy doing that fun and submit it to me by WhatsApp on this number. Here is my WhatsApp number. Do send your answer to this number, Miss Rachel. See you in our next lesson. Bye.